Hey guys, so it's Missy Atlanta and I am here to show you guys a quick Dollar General scenario for April 18th. Um, yeah, so these are 11 items that I plan on picking up. The app calculates it out to be $20.15 less $10 I have in paper coupons making the estimate $10.15. Here's some digital coupons. The Always Discreet, it takes out $0.54 cent for the 5 off 25 For the Nivea, this is the 2.6 ounce, and it's going. Down, this is for four, and I am taking off a dollar sixty-four for the five off twenty-five. For the Dial body wash, um, this is for one, and it is taking off fifty cent for the five off twenty-five. Then I'm going to get a pack of the UVI Cotex tampons in Super. And I have a digital coupon for $1.50. And it's also going to take off $0.59 cent for the 5 off 25 For the Gain Flings, I have a dollar off one digital coupon. And for the 5 off 25 it's taking off $0.71. Cent. For the Gain Ultra Dish Washing Liquid, and this is like the 20 something ounce, I can't remember, uh, 21 ounce <laughs> or larger is what the coupon is for. So it's a dollar off two. And then an additional 72 cent came off of the five off 25. For the Gain Original Dryer Sheets, I'm going to pick up the 34 count. This does work on the 15 count, which is a dollar and it would be absolutely free. However, I chose to use the larger one and the dollar off one digital coupon and an additional 30 cent for the five off 25. So for some of the paper coupons, here's what I use. This $2 off one always discreet coupon came from the April P&G and I'm going to use one of these coupons in that particular transaction. Um, if you read this, you can only use up to two identical coupons of these. So I'm only using one for this particular transaction. So I'm also going to be using four of these $1.50 off one Nivea coupons. The Nivea uh, lotion that I'm picking up is 2.6 ounces. It is not a trial or travel size, so I can use this particular Coupon, this coupon does expire today, um, so this still will not be available in the future. I can use up to four of these coupons because it states limit one coupon per purchase, and that means per item, and limit of four like coupons in same transaction. Um, the last coupon for the Nivea came from the Retail Me Not 4 or 5 as well as these dial coupons. I'm only going to be using one of the dial coupons in this particular transaction, so it's saved two on one. The reason why I'm only using one is because it says limit one coupon per purchase of specified product, blah, 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 which means per item. But it also says limit of one identical coupon per shopping trip. So you're technically only supposed to use one of these coupons in a shopping trip. Because my calculated totals came out just a little bit different than the Dollar General app, which I think is taxes, I'm going to show you my breakdown. So I got all the same prices for all the items I came up to uh, $27.95, which I do realize that I could take one of the $2 items off and go to $25.95. So if you wanted to do that, you could probably save a little bit more. But anyhow... 
The total is $27.95. And then like up here for the always, of course, they don't have the calculation for my paper coupons. So for the always discreet, my final cost is $0.46. Cent. For the lotions, my final cost is $1.36 for four of them. For the body wash, my final cost is $0.25. Cent. For the tampons, my final cost is $1.16. And then for the gang flings, my final cost is $2.24. For the two gang dish soaps, my final cost is $2.25. And the gang dryer sheets, my final cost is $0.70. Cent. Now, I did total up the final costs on the products in the app, and they come out the same. But when I add them up, I only get $8.45 pre-tax but if you guys look back at um hold on so if you look at the totals that the app actually calculated out you will actually come up with the same um 845 after you subtract out the ten dollars in coupons so let's just see how this works out Okay guys, so I'm back from Dollar General and these are the items that I picked up. So as you can see, my transaction was altered. Um, they only had two of the Nivea left. So that's what started the alteration of my transaction. Um, they also did not have the Gain Flings. So I ended up getting the Gain Liquid Laundry Detergent. I like Gain, so um, that was fine with me. The tissue over here I did not think that they were going to have so the 12 family rolls of angel soft is the two ply blah 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 whatever it was five dollars um I used a dollar off one coupon and with the five off 25 received an additional dollar 17 off okay so the dial the lavender and jasmine is not the scent that I actually wanted to pick up I forgot which one it was I wanted it's like in the light blue anyhow the coupon was not working and i find that that happens at dollar general sometimes the coupons only work on specific scents or whatever so that's what happened in this case i ended up having to get this one they're 275 i used the two dollar off one paper coupon from the retail me not um four or five and then an additional 26 cent came off with the um, five off 25. So for the Nivea, I ended up getting two instead of four. These were 225 each. I used a dollar 50 off coupon for each one. And then an additional 22 cent came off for the five off 25. So the always discreet liner, these are uh, $3. I used a paper coupon for $2 off. And then an additional 29 cent came off with the five off 25. So for the gain dish soap back here, these are the 21.6 fluid ounces. These are $2 each. I used a dollar off two digital coupon. And then an additional, I think 20, no, 58 cent came off yes an additional 58 cent came off for the five off 25 now the same thing for the coupons with this one it was only attaching to the you buy Cotex super plus so i picked these up these are the 18 count tampons these are 325 is a dollar off dollar 50 off one coupon and then an additional 51 cent came off of the five off 25. So I also picked up these gain dryer sheets. I got the Island Fresh. This was the only um, scent that they actually had in the 34 count. These are $2. Um, if you are able to find the 15 count, you can get them for absolutely free. These were $1. So there were $2. I used a dollar off one digital coupon and then let me see what came off for the five off 25 i'm gonna go over the receipt anyhow so this one here they didn't have the game flings the game flings are like three something for i forget 
Now, anyhow, I went over that earlier. So then I ended up getting this Gain, just the detergent. This is the 44 ounces, $5. I took off a, I used a dollar off one coupon, making it $4. And then an additional, I think $1.17 came off for this. So let's go over the receipt. So here's the receipt. So you can see the Angel Soft. You see it was $5, $1.17 came off and $1 for the digital coupon. The code, the U by Cotex tampons was $3.25, an additional 51 cent came off as well as the $1.50 digital coupon. You have the um, always discreet liners with $3, $0.29 cent came off and then as well as I used a $2 off paper coupon. For the gain, dryer sheets were $2.00. Additional 29 cent came off as well as the digital coupon for a dollar. Then I have the Nivea here. You see they're 225. 22 cent came off for each. Additional in addition to the dollar fifty off one paper coupons that were used. Um, then you have the gain ultra. That was the what's that one? Oh, those are the dish soaps. I'm sorry. <laughs> so those are two dollars. Twenty nine cent came off in addition to the dollar off two um, coupon that was used. Am I reading this correctly? Sorry. Excuse my nails. I'm getting them done later. Um. Yeah. So let's move on. You have the gain liquid for five dollars. That's the detergent. You see the dollar seventeen and the one dollar coming off the dial two seventy five. You have the twenty six cent coming off and then the two dollar paper coupon. My subtotal was twelve dollars for these items here, which is not bad. And then you have Nevada taxes. Oops, Nevada taxes for a dollar eighty two, making my total thirteen dollars and eighty two cent. I'm also glad to see that they have the paper um, 5 off 25 coupon back on the bottom of the receipts. And I hope that they also have the digital one. As if with that being said, you can do two transactions if you don't have multiple accounts. So, yes, this is it, you guys. Um, I hope this was helpful to you guys. This video was actually just for learning purposes. Some of the deals are no longer available. You have to check the dates. You have to read your coupons, etc. And the 5 off 25 only works on Saturday at Dollar General. So with that being said, I'm going to go ahead and end this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope this video was helpful to you or to someone. And I will see you guys and talk to you in my next video. Bye.